In this video, the girls will get a little bit crazy on the dock before things take a turn for the worse in the water and get painful. We had spent the evening in the quaint little village of Vothi in the Saronic Islands of Greece. All right, we packed this marina up with one, two, three, four, five, six, I think there's seven boats. Uh, so it was kind of nice having us all on the dock here. Run, everybody really enjoyed this place, Vothi. It's kind of quaint little place with cafes on the back. Everybody really thought it was cool. So now we're going to go about nine miles up to, um, I will butcher the word, it's like... What do you call ep it? Epidural. epidural? I don't know. Epidural. It's, it's <laughs> epiduros or that something. That sounds painful. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> epiduros, I don't even know. But there's like an old theater. We're going to see like an ancient Greek theater and all that. It's about nine miles up here, so we're going to head that way. The problem is, is that uh, these boats across the way came in and all dropped their anchors across from us. Who knows how much we're tangled up in there, so we'll see. I'll need to... Uh, you or uh, Dakota on the windless anchor this time. Okay. Miraculously, we ended up not having any crossed anchors and we were able to get out of the harbor with no problems. All right, guys, I got it. Morning. A little more. Dakota pulled up the anchor and we were on our way. This is a kind of experiment because these are the leftovers of yesterday, like these potatoes. So we are gonna try to make a kind of a Spanish omelette. <laughs> but let's see how, how it is. It's gonna be most scrambled eggs with leftover potatoes. The winds were pretty light, so we were motor sailing, but it was still pretty nice conditions. All the boats in this flotilla are from Navigar Yachting. Navigar has 10 bases around the world with more than 300 boats. If you'd like to charter in Greece or any of their other destinations, use code DOODLE on checkout and receive $200 off your booking. And be sure to ask them about their ownership program where you get guaranteed income. Just in time for us to dock. Breakfast is served. The dock at Epidurus was getting pretty full, so it was time to squeeze in. At first, we were going to dock next to this catamaran, but we found out that there was no docking allowed there. Somebody grab one of the forward fenders over here, and we're going to make sure we don't hit this guy. Yeah, so just, just you're gonna hold it back here to make sure we don't tap against them. Well, we're just trying to get, find space on the dock. Um, so, I mean, we got like six boats and they're all full. They're all full, so we're trying to figure it out. <laughs> it's tired when I did it. Did you do, do what you're doing to me all the time? Oh, I got him a thousand times. He almost flew off the boat the other day. <laughs> so? Uh, so yeah, we're just waiting for uh, a spot to clear. We're gonna side tie a few boats together, and uh, yeah, we'll figure it out. This other boat right here that's alongside is about to leave, so I think we'll probably try to get this spot. Soon a few of the boats left, and there was space for us on the dock. We had to leave the end of the dock open, so we brought our stern alongside. Want to thread it through both and go up, or just keep it? Yeah, let's just. I mean, we'll get a, we'll get set and then then reset. Yeah. Just yeah. give it back to it. All right, I think I'm on my anchor pretty good there now. Yeah, tight. Wait, no, no, no. Just tie it off real quick. Tie it off. Yeah, yeah. Oh, come on, really? One more try. I caught the spreader with the damn You got thing. three tries. Okay, so yeah, you here. I had a great attempt to throw a line to our other boat that was pulling alongside. Yeah. 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 
Ya, baby. <laughs> Pulling on the lines, we cozied the catamaran right up next to us. This is the beautiful town of Epidauros. Pretty much all Greek towns have their church as their central landmark. It's a popular place for charter and sailors, and you can see their innovative ways of rafting up. Epiduros even has its own ancient amphitheater that is still in use today for concerts. With all the boats safely on the dock, it was time to head to lunch. No space is too narrow. <laughs> yeah, for sure. They really squeeze them in here. Squeeze them in, make it work. Yeah. Uh, we're going to lunch over there if you want to join. Right. No. So what do we get to dessert? <laughs> really? I'm gonna lay on As usual, the girls got a little crazy at lunch. <laughs> oh, get it! Oh. Why are we playing this game? No, guys, don't do it. Oh, no. <laughs> no. I don't want. I don't trust a picture anymore. You can become a patron to get the uncut, unedited version. <laughs> After lunch, we headed to the beach where things took an unfortunate turn. Sea urchins. <laughs> There's no sea urchins over here. Yeah, she's looking her foot. Look at my foot. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's very painful. It's truly painful. So I'm just acting yeah, as a taxi. So all you feet people, leave a comment wow. down below how you want to help her out. Unfortunately, Nieves wasn't the only one to step on a sea urchin. A little merman. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Did you get one too? It's because we were talking about eating them and they're like, screw yeah, you. And that's what it is. We need the, um, the so tongs. Hurt. No, oh, f my life. Oh. No, no, no. Oh, no. Hold on. <laughs> Come on, Daddy L. Daddy L, yeah. yeah. On my calling, uh -huh. escorting <laughs> women out of the water. Whoa, whoa, what'd you call us? <laughs> Just looking at it, it looks so bloody painful. I told all of them before getting to water. Be careful, there is a lot of the sea or to whatever. Yeah. Some nice passersby that actually gave the ladies a ride back All to the right, dock. Alright, so the sea urchin uh, victims got a ride back to the dock and then it's surgery time to get the yeah. spine oh, up. Bobby, I, we need your help, you know? You, uh, we have a lot of pain here in our foot. Please help us. <laughs> no, I'm not ready. It was one of the worst I've seen. Luckily, we had a nurse in the flotilla. I'm gonna sit here and just close my eyes. Just close your eyes and don't talk. All right, uh, we're all getting ready to do uh, one last night out on the water because we got to go back to the marina uh, tomorrow. We'll kind of do a dinner there too. Uh, got myself shaving, of course, because it's rolly out here. Because uh, the wind, 12 knots, coming from here. Uh, wasn't forecast, but whatever. Now we're looking at it. It says it should shift around the other way in the next 
Well, I thought it'd be already shifted by now, but that's grease for you. The wind's has a mind of its own. But we're doing okay. Uh, we're gonna go find dinner. We loaded up all the flotilla crews and met up for one last dinner out in the islands. The flotilla in Greece really was a fun time. It was great getting to meet the new faces and a lot of the faces that were returning. Our next flotilla is in the Bahamas in the Abacos, October 21st through the 28th. I believe there might be one boat left. There's a link in the description if you'd like more information on that. And in just a few weeks, we'll be doing a drawing to invite one of our patrons to join us on our boat in the Bahamas. By the way, I have a new podcast out explaining all my experiences at the most recent Burning Man. You can head over to the Sailing Doodles podcast on YouTube or wherever you get your audio podcasts.